गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स वन सेकेंड आई वेलकम यू फ्रॉम शेयर स्टडिंग स्कूल डॉट कॉम फॉर निफ्टी एनालिसिस टूडे एट मार्च टू थाउजेंड निफ्टी ट्रेडिंग वी हैव बीन ट्रैकिंग फॉर लास्ट फ्यू ब्लेज निफ्टी आर बी चार्ट एंड इफ यू रिमेंबर इन रजिस्टर डेज रिपोर्ट वी हैड एक्चुअली प्लॉटेड रेजिस्टेंस लेवल एट सेवन Indeed, uh, yesterday's uh, uh, last trade trading session, Nifty has tested a resistance at around seven thousand five hundred and five, seven thousand five hundred and four. Seven thousand five hundred and five. This level has acted as a tremendous, a uh, big uh, resistance, and almost three hours. That is, it is only three hours. Nifty tried to cross that level, but could not and failed. Hence, this level is very crucial level now. Seven thousand five hundred and six, to be precise, should act as a very big resistance now. Today, internationally, market is in corrective mode. In chances are there that Nifty may open slightly lower than the last previous closing value. But however, do not go short or do not think about going short because if you can see that in this uh, pattern there is a uptrend because it's a rising bottom and we are actually. Trading above this trend line, which is up trend line. So, if at all Nifty opens and starts correction, because Nifty in hourly chart shows it's a overbought condition and it's consistently overbought. Invalid crossover of 50 and 100 has taken place almost five six hours back. So, overbought market, invalid crossover, consistent resistance, all these things actually favors that there will be a minor correction. Please remember this correction is actually nothing but just a profit booking and try and seek a support and accumulate and form a base and then again move further north. So next support level which is expected that this gap should act as a very good support. So seven thousand four hundred and six to seven thousand three hundred and seventy six. Seven thousand four hundred and six and seven thousand three hundred and seventy six. This level, this gap should act as a very good support. As in past, prices accumulated at that level. First, second, there is a gap in this for last trading session, and there is a 20 moving average, exponential moving average is also lying at that level. So these three factors actually justifies that 7,406 to 7,376. This price level should act as a very good support for Nifty. And further, the fourth important point is that trend line is also almost going from the same range. Hence, we are expecting Nifty, if at all it opens with a minus or a lower than the last closing, then should seek support at seven thousand four hundred and six. So there is no question of going short. Please do not seek any chance to go short in this market. However, for going long, actually we will have to wait and watch for seven thousand. Five hundred and six to breach. If in case seven thousand five hundred and six to breach, then we will keep a target of seven thousand five hundred and sixty-three. This level should take as a, resi a resistance or a target, and then that moment we will keep a stop loss of this uh, level that is around this low. Rather, uh, I'll just mark that level so that we will be. Precisely, should be able to under seven thousand four hundred and forty-four should be our stop loss. If in case Nifty breaches seven thousand five hundred and six, sustain above that level for at least half an hour, and then we will go long. We will keep a target of seven thousand five hundred and sixty-three with a stop loss of seven thousand four hundred and forty-four. If Nifty opens negative or with minus or a. Uh, uh, Lower than the previous lows, the chances are very high. Don't go short because there are various supports, and these supports need to be tested. Actually, for further right and uptrend move, this accumulation is needed. So probably today we may not get a trading opportunity, but we will have to wait and watch for this situation that whether Nifty really breaches not. So uh, thank you very much and happy trading. Thank you.